All right. How long have I been indulging myself? Hour 20. Hour oh, 20. Jesus. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's do one rap because I want to do one without the Fuck audience. Yeah. Is there a beat? Can I get a beat? Now. I was thinking with the. Now, with, 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 now, you, you just now. do this while I while I talk. Don't don't let anything <laughs> I say distract you from beat picking. But but uh, I was thinking like uh, like beat picking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, an, an advantage of the uh, of the of the, you, of the of the no audience laugh. format could be I, that. Sorry. Could, uh, we 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 did. Uh, <laughs> I could put headphones on. We're not going to do that this week. I could put headphones on and hear the beat. You could do it too. Like we could hear the metronome. We would hear the beat, but then we rap into the live stream, and then somebody out there, like these guys, are really Make good at like they music. take the stuff and then they can oh. add music and they'd have cleaner audio. I hear what you're saying. I did a thing. I did the thing at the top of last week's podcast of the booth. That was like, I just did. The, I just riffed this like. Uh, Harmontown thing and uh, and and this audio engineer Harry like he uh, he he added like all this he, he like produced it and it's like fuck, it sounds fucking amazing it's like I don't know how he put me on tempo and like uh, we didn't start with it because it's like it's very gospel and there was a horrible church shooting and it's like I was like I don't know if I'm being a over cuck but I was just like I don't know I don't even want those dots connected hilarious <laughs> we could probably we could play it now that you set it up you know uh, I, you, you already you already like created deniability you know right <laughs> Already. Also, by the time you know, by the time this goes out, the will all be over the church shooting. Do you, right. <laughs> oh yeah, the beat. Okay. Okay, you ready? Yo, 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 yeah, yo, 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 bro, yeah, yo, yo, trees, leaves, roots. Sleeves, <laughs> dirt, earth, pebbles, base, tick 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 treble, rapping at you with my lips. I fucked your mama so hard, I sunk her titties, ships, Trafalgar, Waterloo, it was her end. I fucked your mama so hard, she made my penis bend. She's like a pussy prism. She made my dick contort and refract and reflect of the world's worst things. <laughs> I made your mama sing. She said, la 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 la, I love Dan's penis. I'm committed to your mom. I'm gonna take her to the prom, even though I'm 44 and she's 50. We thought that it would be nifty. It's not nostalgia. It's not the school we went to. Picking one at random and seeing what they do when a middle-aged couple walks in the door and pretends that it's their prom and gets on the dance floor. Will they police us? Will they try to stop the beat? I don't know. Let's find out. The truth is in the street. Obama and Trump need to go back to school. I'm just an angry rapper and I'm going to... Okay, God damn it, I can't do that. <laughs> All right. That was a good... That was a solid rap. <laughs> going to the prom, but I'm 44. Wait, no, no. <laughs> Even though I, I'm sure we all we're all lateral thinkers, but no one wants to hear from the rapper right now that says Obama and Trump need to go back to school, right? Like we're just not, we don't, I was with you. It's too high resolution. Like like it's like well what well then who are you rooting for? I liked it because I was like I I got to see him justify this one because <laughs> they didn't learn the delegates. I want I just want to be I want to who's the who's the guy? I love the I like the I like the like not just the angry it's not angry like the gruff the gruff rappers like who's DMX. The guy? DMX. Yeah, like the, or the guys that are like, rawr, they like growl yeah, while DMX. they're rapping. Like, yeah. I want to be a growl rapper, but it, it, and the, but the reason I want to be is because is the same reason I can't be because I think that <laughs> takes more. You need more science to drop that much science. I mean, you do have to know your rhyme pretty well to growl right. throughout. Um, <laughs> DMX was super good at it because he would just stop and. <laughs> 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 and he would start his shit off with like, get at me. I'm coming for you. Turn on the lights. Pull my pants down. Oh. And then would rap. And then Busta Rhymes, 
classic. Yeah. Oh, rawr, yeah. Rawr, like a well, dungeon he would, he, dragon. He would, he would start. Yeah. yeah he, he would get revved up like a little seventies like wind up toy. <laughs> and, and then like like uh, go, Ghostface Killer. Like it was. Uh, I think it was like above all my favorite because he would start like Slick Rick kind of like. Yeah. He like I'm Ghostface Killer and I'm here to say he doesn't he never said that. <laughs> <laughs> but I came to rap in but a he would like. But, but I come he would to kill go, in a Ghostface go, go, Ghostface way. Killer would like 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 by the time he got to the end of a thing, I felt like like I always imagined that he'd be going like this like I do because he'd be like. Oh, yeah. Like yeah. he's like yelling, like shouting, like he can't, he can't, he can't fucking take it anymore. And then like just like, yeah. Oh man, I would love to see people who aren't you doing the kicky baby dance. Yeah, <laughs> it would be amazing. I mean, it's amazing when you don't do it. It too. would be cool. It would, it would, it would be, it would be helpful if, uh, if the hip hop community started. Uh, Adopting my, 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 my ways. I'm sure that's already happening. <laughs> I do want to go to like a, a, just like a hut on a back road in Atlanta and find like just jet black Armenians doing your dance <laughs> and, ra- and wrap it in your same pattern. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I told you, man, you can't talk about that, man. You're not depressed like damn, man. No, dude. Spit again. <laughs> you don't Spit mean again. <laughs> You're not on the spectrum. Right, right. I saw you shaking hands with people and hugging them and shit. You're not on the spectrum. <laughs> Yo, if you're going to stim when you rap, it should be because you need to stim to get by. It shouldn't be because you do like, it's like, this is about what our culture is. <laughs> I'm not self-diagnosing. I don't know. My, my, my uh, therapist keeps telling me I don't have autism. How are you going to be a Dan Harmon rapper and your DJ name is Strobe Light? <laughs> You know you would have a seizure and freak out. <laughs> that's so offensive. You're thinking of epileptics. It's like, I'm black, man. What y'all going to do, man? That's like, <laughs> Come at me, epileptics. Come at me. <laughs> I dare you, epileptics. <laughs> <laughs> calling autistic people epileptic is like calling uh, Samuel L. Jackson Lionel Richie. In that no one's going to write a letter? Is that how they're the same? Yes, the stakes are pretty low. <laughs> Did you ever see this YouTube clip of Sam Jackson is like doing press for some movies doing, and then like the, the like morning show host like said, I think he he says something that makes it clear that he has confused him with I think Morgan Freeman or it's either Morgan Freeman or Wesley Snipes. Okay, it's one of those. But and then and then like I just I don't remember yeah. anything about it except just like awkward because it was just yeah. like it was just like the because it was like Jackson didn't let it go because wh- how could he right. you can't even even if he wanted to be a, a a team player he could like how are you supposed to bounce back from that right. after 1995 and like right. he, he's a, he was like he's just like no we're gonna talk about this now and then yeah. and then the morning show guy's like okay all right come on now <laughs> it's like well you. Literally dehumanized me. You yeah. confused me. It would be one thing. I mean, yes, uh, if you were a valet Parker and you like, oh, I forgot which one had the Porsche because same hair color. But like, you booked him on your show and you thought he did a different movie. That's we got to stop doing television now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We have to stop and take a, a, a little time out here. Uh, Especially that- if you get your fame off of me. If the reason that you're famous is because you interview celebrities, right? Like what? I, right. What? What am I milking today? Well, right. you're milking this cow. Oh, well, right. I. <laughs> yeah. How's it feeling being this cow? I'm not this cow. I'm that cow. Well, whatever. <laughs> Come on. Let's not disrupt the farm. Milk is milk. That's what, that's what Ghostface would say. Uh, <laughs> milk, milk is milk. milk. Throw your hands up. No, no, no. I can't, I, you can't. You can't. You can't riff an impression of Ghostface. You can, uh, you can do it if you go by casinos. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was it? What was, yeah, all right. I was trying to think of one of his rhymes. But uh, uh, did, well, did you see the Eminem thing, by the way? The, I did. Uh, I mean, everybody did. But, I did. Uh, his, I'm not going to give it the four stars that everybody else has given it, but right. I do appreciate the effort. Well, yeah. what, what's, I mean, every, I want to hear the detraction. It could have been better. It could have been better. It's offbeat. The, the rhyming, it's, uh, yeah, it's not clear. But don't you think he's what? What if he's what if he's are you, do, what if he's actually really making it up on the spot? What if he he did? He's out of practice. Yeah, it's not the old. And, okay, so normally he'll do like a a a a a a a a rhyme pattern where he's just rhyming word after word after word, mm-hmm. right? And he didn't do that. That's classic M.M. Mm, he didn't do that. He did more of like a a yell speak spoken word poetry and when you're as lyrically talented and you can flow like he is like he can you sort of expect him it'd be like you know it, it'd be like it's like when prince would come out and he would just do an acoustic set and you'd be like nah mm. <laughs> nah yeah but the combination i guess of like because like the stakes are so much higher because it's like like oh he's just oh 
he's saying I hate Trump, and it's like that's like controversial, which is a fucked up thing. He's like two years late. There's a lot of rappers that had already dissed Trump the, right out the gate. So that was the other issue. Yeah, but he know what I'm saying is that he knows the weight of the train he's driving to to what to what station and what wall it's going to go through and whatever. Like you and I are talking about it, I don't know about these other guys. So yeah. he he knows that he's whether whatever he thinks about himself. I'm just saying like that would affect that would affect me too. Why am I arguing with you? I asked your opinion. I, 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 it's I, your privilege. I, I, was, I, was, I, 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 I was just, uh, yeah. I was like, 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 why do we do that to people? We go like, like, well, what did you think? And then you go like, well, I didn't like it. And you're like, well, t- t- tell me why you didn't like it. And then they tell and you it, why. And you're like, well, I don't know about that though. I'd also like to say you didn't address the technical. That's, that's my only beef. Right. 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 Actually, truly, I wasn't really, th- there was, there was some rhymes in there where I was like, holy shit, that's pretty awesome. But truly, the reason why I did think it was awesome is because as a fragile white dude who loved Eminem and who is probably his age and who like just feels helpless and Eminem's got you know like it's like well he's not a he's not a role model and he's not nor even in hip-hop or whatever it was like he he reappears, and I always thought he was talented. I guess he, I feel like he's like the Quentin Tarantino of rapping or something. <laughs> like, no, he's like, pretty. He's like, pretty high up there. I'm like always in he his corner. Props. I'm like, I wish people. I wish. I wish. And, 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 and then, and then, and I was just happy to see him again, and he looked good. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about that beard. That beard was a little. <laughs> <laughs> and and he was like fervently yes. fucking like anar- anarchically political in his yes. messaging in a way that was just like straight up. That that is I was the reason I was excited about it was because of all those things. And he didn't fuck up and like right. like he didn't like say uh, north south east west. Uh, uh, the, the dog is your friend best. I don't know why you got scared that he was going to fuck up. <laughs> I don't, well, th- th- because he was freestyling, right? I mean... Uh-uh. He wasn't? No. Well, now I hate it. No, I no, thought no. It was no freestyling. It's still incredible. I it's thought he was incredible. freestyling. No. The, a freestyle... Well, then why was he going... He can was I going tell you like, what's wait, fucked hold up? hold on. Oh, hold it. Like, he was like, I here's, start over. Here's, what's, here's the most fucked up thing, is that our generation, freestyling is off the top of the dome. Younger kids think freestyling is when you don't have a musical track, and you are... Um, you're doing your song a cappella, so it, it's almost like remember remix used to be this is a new version of that song with the same lyrics, mm. and now remix is just a longer version of a song or a different beat that isn't quite the same. You fucking so kids, and here's what of, freestyling used to be. Hit it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, y'all about to be taken back to what freestyle used to be. Yeah. When people I, got confused yo, in their rhymes. Peas and carrots, soups and plates. What? I tried to fuck your mama, but oh, it's her I hate. Oh, I'm a hateful person, and I hate your mom. So why did I fuck her? My name is Tom. Mr. Cruz is what they call me. I'd like to tell you about Scientology. You get your thetans clear, get them off your back, and then you give me $5,000 back. Uh, L. Ron Hubbard is the man to beat. I want to fuck your mama's titties, going to put my dick in her feet. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I was, now I, that I, is off the, that's freestyle. Then I thought I'd throw it to you. But but, but now they're like, I'm going to do my song that you guys all know about, but I'm going to do it a cappella, so now I'm freestyling. Right. There's also yeah, that's it. Well, I also really? heard a distinction. I was talking to Open Mike uh, about about the Eminem thing, and we were talking about freestyling and like what what is the I was talking about like what are the rules, like what's the religion surrounding freestyling? Like like when Eminem and the Slim Shady uh, uh, album, what the fuck was it? Where he's like he's freestyling and it's like 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 how much are you allowed to edit if you got busted editing would it be like a milli yes. vanilli scandal yes. you know you cannot edit if it's on your album it's like a freestyle track does it is it like a scandal if someone like leaks the thing and you're like taking 10 minutes and going wait uh, i should rhyme sugar with yeah. booger yeah that's not, so that's unjust. but mike was saying uh that like for instance there's then there's another distinction where it's like rappers like jay-z will they pride themselves on not writing anything down, but they don't mean they're freestyling. They just mean they don't use pen and paper. They right. just like play themselves like an instrument. Like they'll and they'll they're like Pink Floyd about it. Like they'll they're just doing it in layers and passes and like going off the off their head, but they're refining it. There's people who are going off their head, and then there are people who have memorized freestyle rhymes. I, I imagine if you constantly freestyling, then you're gonna know mouth rhymes with South. Right. You know it's gonna happen. We all run through the A. Through the E, through the D, work our way to the shuns, T-I-O-Ns. 
and then we get we get freakier with that. So everybody's going to be like, I went today to see some pay, and I went yeah. my way, and then they're going to move on to it's easy to see to be me. It's so easy to be he, and then that's what I try to do. So the complexity is always like, can you do what Emin- Eminem is super complex in that he goes a a a a mm. for the whole first line, which is bananas. When he said, and that's hard to freestyle because you you need a dictionary, which you, it, you know. he also just thinks phonetically or something. That's what impresses me about like good like yeah. freestyles when people are like, oh, they don't even they like they like hear in sound. So it's like, I stole your mama's Acura, wrecked it, and sold it back to her. It's like that doesn't rhyme. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. like I it doesn't rhyme to me, but it it does when you say it if you think also, in rhymes. Also, like kids nowadays don't rhyme anymore. So somebody oh, yeah. will, somebody will say basket, and somebody will say kick it, and it's the <laughs> it that you were supposed you to be kids. rhyming off. But Wait, back did you in the run day, out of your magic words. You got to you you back in the day. You you had to rhyme. Words had to rhyme, and it couldn't be a party chant all of a sudden. Like just because you didn't rhyme, it couldn't suddenly become a hook. That's what happens when you strip language down. <laughs> you got rid of the word Eskimo. Now, how are you going to rhyme? Give me some mo. <laughs> Can't rhyme Inuit. You fucked yourself, millennial freestylers. Into it. <laughs> like a, I never met an Inuit that wasn't into it. I never met an Inuit that wasn't into it. You could, okay. 